Kiki Palmer, baby. She's revealing y'all that her parents went 50 50 financial. And she also admitted y'all that, you know, um, she doesn't expect from, you know, her partner to make as much money as she does, which a lot of people, honey, some money that, you know, we know don't agree with that, though. But, you know, she's saying that she's being realistic about, you know, financially, for, you know, how her parents were down. Now, she was recently on a, a, a um, podcast. And, you know, she talked about how she handles money in her relationship after opening up about becoming a millionaire at just 12 years old. Here's what Kiki had to say. My parents, at their best, made $40,000 a year. I was making that a show. You know, and I think the thing about it is somebody can say, okay, but well, that was your money. Yeah, but we're a family. And everybody sacrificed for me yeah. to be where I'm at. My, my dad gave up his pension. Okay, he had worked at the company he worked at for over 15 years, gave up his pension for me to have opportunity for my dreams. My mother, they gave up everything. She gave up everything so she could travel with me yeah. and do what she needed to do with me. So how I feel about it is what's mine is, is theirs, what's theirs is mine. Right. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. I love to hear a grown child say that about their parents. Yeah. Well, and have that reflection. Well, yeah, and that's good. But then, but she's also talked about, you know, her um, um, her future man. She said to expect everybody to have become a millionaire at 12 and learn money management and have a business manager at 12. To me, she said, it just seems not realistic. She said, I started yeah. working at 10. She said, I started working 10, 15 years um, before most of my generation. And the first job, honey, she said, I don't hold people to those standards. Standards. She said, if I wanted somebody that made as much as me, this would be a date, honey, and not an interview. And she said, when it comes to guys her age, she said, every now and then, you might find somebody that's out there making it. But most of the time, she said, like she talked about her mom and dad, they went 50-50 on all of their things in life. So she said, when I hear some of the stuff that people is, you know, saying about relationships mm -hmm. and dates, she said, I'm just kind of like, uh. I don't know, honey, um, how that's going to work today because uh, maybe I'm just tripping or whatever. But a lot of people saying, girl, you crazy. She's put it out there that the man don't have to make as much money as her. And she said that she doesn't need him to buy her everything. She could buy her own stuff and what have you. She, 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 she a good person because when I made it, I put my mom and dad out of my house. They was homeless for about two years. I got I was tired of it. It was too strict. You, so stupid. <laughs> Shut up. Yeah, well, off. okay. <laughs> She's a lie. Shut up. They got an apartment now, but they yeah, <laughs> but I mean, but Ricky, though, I mean, but she's saying that a man that had to make, I mean, you know, we work with somebody, I mean, that, you know, don't, I mean, really agree with it. I mean, our, our, our Gen X, would you want your man to make um, less money than you, Taylor, or would you, you want to make more money than him? Um, I would prefer for him to make more money than me. Why? Um, several reasons. I just feel like, um, I don't know. That's just how I was raised. My dad made more than my mom. He took care of the house. I just feel like that's how, I'm more traditional in that sense. Yeah, but we got the and new I, man. No, and, and, and nothing wrong with that tra tradition. That tradition in that sense is 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 the way it's supposed. You know, it's it's perfect. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, those old heads don't think that way, honey. So you know. Okay, I now mean, you get to a woman and she taking care of you. She making more money than you. Now you gonna you gonna get emasculated at every turn. Yep. Okay. Uh -huh. You're gonna get but it's going to be loud. hard to make more money than Kiki because she probably, listen, if she's making a million dollars a year, that's over $80,000 a month. But she's surrounded a guy by people in, who make in a that business. kind of money, though. Yeah, but I mean, if you, you may not want a guy in the business that's all up in the mix like you, and that's really hard to, to match that standard. You can mm -hmm. find an amazing guy that makes $20,000 a month is still a lot of money. Me so, I mean, it's, make, it's different. It's let me different find somebody to make more money than me. I'll make up for it. I, I'll make it seem like I make more money. I'll okay. make up for it. Yeah. Hey, Kay. Yeah. Kay, yeah. I'll, make up, I'll make up for it. I have you yeah. thinking you're making money on wage. <laughs> you forget about that, that check. You're dropping that bomb here on your neck. <laughs> The Kahluna Day honey, is one of my I'm favorite cheap, My Kahluna Day is sangria. <laughs> on the high end, you say sangria, and on the lawn, you say maroon. That's your Kahluna for the That's day. Hey, Kenny. Get your mind off that paycheck. <laughs> 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 Put your okay. knees on your heels. Oh, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to put my paycheck stuff in my face when I'm clapping them cheeks. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you doing that channel?